brothers this series is going to be slightly different i'm going to be taking the stream and cutting it up into episodes if you want to be here for the stream i'll be streaming crusader kings 3s on sundays at 11 a.m enjoy the show brothers welcome to crusader kings and the game of throne mods yes we're live twice in one weekend i was so stoked for this mod to come out so I wanted to jump into it with you guys. I played with it for a little bit prior to this. There are some things changed. There's actually a lot of things changed, which I'm very stoked about. There's a lot of new events, obviously new buildings, new characters, things like that. Most importantly is the way sieges work and how you get territory. So in previous Game of Thrones, you were able to like form a Cassis Belle on a territory and then take it. You can't do that. That's not an option with your counselor anymore. The, the other thing is uh, when you would siege a castle, you would take the entire province. No, in this one, you have to siege everything in the province. So you got to siege the chapel, the town, and the castle to be able to get it all. Let's go ahead and jump into it with a new game. So for this one, we're going to be playing as, as you can see, you, this is starting in Robert's Rebellion. There are two start points, Robert's Rebellion, and then right after Robert's Rebellion, where Robert uh, becomes the king. Unfortunately, there is no House of Dragons yet type mod, but that is perfectly fine. So we're going to be starting out here, and I do have a selection point in mind. So if you've never seen Game of Thrones, it's a Game of Thrones. It's a game of fighting between different kingdoms. These are all the different kingdoms. There's Doran, the Reach, Stormlands, Crownlands, Westerlands, the Riverlands, the Vale, and the North. Now, you can also play up here as the First Men. I have not explored these guys at all, and unfortunately, East is all gone. We can't do that yet. But there was that option in CK2, so that might be coming down the road. So my plan here today is a little bit different. What I always wanted to see is Hall. I have always wanted to see what Hall would look like, but I don't necessarily want to start out as a duke. So my plan is, is hold on, this game is uh, really chugging along. It's not super optimized yet. So my plan is right now, is I'm going to start as, let's start as this guy. I'm going to start as Lordship of Briar White with my inevitable goal to take Hall as my own and then conquer this duchy and become the new duke. So that is my plan. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and take this character just to see. We'll take a look at what he looks like later on, but he's just humble and patient. That's a little bit unfortunate. Better than this guy, though. St stubborn, statistic, and zealous are all terrible traits. So we'll go ahead and start the game going from here okay so we're in the game let's see we have two territories which is good two domain territories so we have spine keep which is a great name spine keep has a regimental clearing which gives us a little bit of extra levies which is nice and then what does this have over here hog hall has just a, a small hill fort and then you have a dry moat and a bastion curtain okay what does milk start out with they start with wooden barricade barracks okay so what I would like to start is I would really love to get this farm, this manor house. I would love to get the manor house and then the farm and fields and then potentially replace the dry moat with the apiaries because they do give a little bit. I might even get rid of this, to be honest with you. We'll have to kind of make that decision down the road here a little bit, but let's first start out with going down our lifestyle. So we are diplomatic. I hate being diplomatic, but that's fine. We'll go ahead and get more prestige out of this and go from there and let's see oh we have to choose a patron aspect so this is another different thing it's the faith of the seven so since we are diplomacy let's go ahead and boost our diplomacy ever so slightly i would love to get my stewardship up actually what's my stewardship at is it worth boosting nine yeah let's go ahead and boost let's go ahead and boost stewardship as long as it doesn't take away from le yeah learning is fine so we'll go ahead and say the smith is our patron we have a decision to make we need to uh, send for a maester from the Citadel, so we will go ahead and send for one of those. All of this is basically similar. We Also, we can request a loan from the Iron Bank of Bravos. And our heir is unmarried, so let's go ahead and get him married. So you are my heir. Window Wode. <laughs> Window Wode. <laughs> that sounds made up. He's an amateur plotter and a knight. That's kind of crap. Uh, what are you? Rowdy, you're educated and martial. Let's get you educated um i want to educate the child i want to get somebody who has a good marshal to do that you are pretty good 
I like you though, because you could give him diligent. That's what I'm gonna go ahead and say. You are gonna be that guy's ward. My this son is pretty terrible, to be honest with you. He's lazy, he's impatient, and he's arrogant. All terrible traits, and he's an amateur plotter. But there's no real way for me to get rid of him right away, so we will go ahead and marry him. Now, good for us, there is a Rivenlander who gives us a alliance with our Lord, who is calmly. So that is a great start for us. We are going to just accept that right here. And we'll go ahead and we'll go ahead and start the game. So looking over here, Wendell Wode can marry. We've got that. Hire a Maester. We've also got that. Um, the Maester I've sent for the Citadel has arrived. A Reachman by the name of Walgrave. Let's hope he is will be loyal and wise. How good is the Walgrave? He's decent. He's a physician, so that's nice. Okay. Let's also set up our council. Now the council works a little bit different. Where we have <laughs> hold on. Let's time out. Okay, so let's go ahead and set up the people that we know. Marshall, we want to train commanders. You are disrupting schemes. You are going to be increasing the development in the capital. You do fine. And then we have the hand position. So instead of being able to do things like form a Cassis belly, it's right now he's, he's assigned to do his best. <laughs> this, was, this was more options earlier. I'm not sure if it's just my son, but he assists in all things, which is very unfortunate. Um, I do... Oh. What is this? Oh, that's my liege. Okay, so this shows my liege's council. That's very nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started from here. First thing we're going to want to do is get the manor houses. So we're going to be saving up for that. This is going to take a long time to be able to get going from there. Corgi, if you want better skills, the person teaching has to be of higher learning as well. Uh, that is for learning. So like the guy who's educating my child is of good martial. He's got a good martial education. So he's a dutiful captain. But more importantly, I want him to give diligent. Diligent is the thing I want him to give my son. This son is my or is my spare, so I'm not super concerned about him being the absolute best right now. Let's go ahead and speed things up because this is going to take a long time to be able to do anything. Powerful vassal expects a court position. Who are you? Are you any good at anything? You can be my spy master. Let's go ahead and replace you. Yeah, you're a vassal. You're important. We need to get you up on there. There you go. Mission solved. Wait, who's this? Oh, this is the other one. Okay. Um, the first time it happened, I barely gave it a moment's stop, but my vassal maester Roderick has go grown bolder. His challenges no longer pass unnoticed amongst my vassal. He is testing my limits. The others are sure to follow, unless I give him a taste of his own medicine. Um, let's see. I can ignore him, which will give me a weak hook. Let's see. All these kind of... Let's just say... Commenting on his grace. We have a good diplomacy. Ah, darn it. Okay, that didn't work. Are you any good at anything else? Not really. Uh, yeah, you just, you'll be the last, you'll be the man left out. Now, we can't declare any wars. We can't declare any cast his bellies. So, as you can see, we need to cast his belly to uh, declare war on this guy. So, right now, it's just going to be about building up our kingdom. Hopefully, we'll eventually get something overall. Learning improves the overall uh, skills in generals. Yes, it does. But uh, my guy doesn't have too much learning. It's okay. Learning also helps out with technology, which right now, as you can see, this is our culture. So we are family business, which gives a little bit of counselor opinion um, and stuff. We have hit and run tactics, which is great for retreating, which we're not going to try and do. But light skirmishing and cavalry is going to be very important. We're strong believers. So zealous is going to be very common. Life is a joke. So gregarious, con content, cynical, and fickle give increased opinion towards characters. And we're a tournament on the trident, which means we get a little bit less cost for building in the forest in the taiga. So, and then innovations right now, we are working on the trebuchet. We are in the high industrial sector of the map. Ooh, let, let it be known far and wide from Westeros to Esros and the lands beyond that the Mad King Eris II Targaryen has perished. King's Landing has fallen, taking the ruling Targaryen dynasty with it. So, Robert Baratheon has prevailed. The Iron Kingdom is once more filled and let's see, Lord Paramount Remley of the Stormlands has risen up against King Robert of the Iron Throne in the revolt against King Robert. I must choose to stand with King Robert of the Iron Throne and join Remley of the Stormlands or I can stay neutral. I see no reason to get involved. A new claimant. In Lord Leveway's inane efforts to improve my relationship with my neighbors, my good-for-nothing Chancellor has officially acknowledged Lord Manfred's claim to the Lordship of Shorehedge. That's unfortunate. So someone got a claim on us. Ah! That was exactly the opposite of what you were supposed to do. Well, let's take a look at our military. So we have five knights, which is good. We are getting raided. No, no, no. That's not us. 
just the riverlands in general are getting raided we have three river bows Ooh, this is um do we have any unique armor men just the river bows okay that's really good we could also potentially get a trebuchet but for right now i'm focusing on the economy because i'm only earning 3.6 gold a month which is not very good so with this character i'm definitely going to focus in on getting as much economy up and going as possible i am a gust though which is great so Augusta Knight, child of my dynasty, my son has had an heir, Kyle. All right, Kyle's a terrible name. We need a name suggestion. Give me a name suggestion, boys. Okay, we got Frank, we got Charlie, we got Gerald, we got Jesus. <laughs> I like, um, we'll call him, we'll call him Frank. We'll call him Frank. May you go strong and wise, Frank. Frank Wood. <laughs> All right, so... Hopefully we'll be able to educate Frank in a more effective way because is I do not want my son and heir to be able to uh, educate him. You are hereby invited to the Grand Tourney of Casterly Rock. Do I have any? No, my no, no, no. I've got better things to do. Uh, yeah, I don't want to get hurt or anything, so I'm going to avoid that as much as possible. If I had higher martial, I might join that. But for right now, just slow and steady is what's going to earn us the race here. Constantinople, that would have been a good one. We'll definitely add that one on. Okay, so we got a new diplomacy option here. Let's go with groom to rule. Wait, will this give it to my... No, that's just my children. So let's go ahead and get a friend, which is the best thing in diplomacy. And we'll start working down our counselors to make them our friends. Starting with my son, who will definitely want to be my friend. Yeah. Oh, 53%. What the heck? Okay, my second son has grown up. He is a skilled tactician. So he's actually kind of good. That's a shame. We'll get him married, but I first want to find someone to uh, a friend. I need a friend. 100%. That's what we need to do. Let's get you in here. And Lordship of Honeyholt. This might be a good one. Where are you? Where's Honeyholt at? Honeyholt is down south. That's a little bit far away. Let's see if we can go ahead and manage a little bit of... Give me this. Let's see if we can find anybody closer by. Like, this guy would be really good. Let's see if you have any daughters. You have this daughter. Is she betrothed? No. Let's go ahead and see if she wants to marry my son. Yes. That will be great. That's a good alliance. Okay. Are you in Alaska? No, brother. I'm in uh, Game of Thrones. I'm in Harrenhal. Yes. Okay. So, Harrenhal, for those who don't know, is kind of in the center of the map. So, Harrenhal was before the uh, Targaryens invaded this was like the capital so basically these guys over here had invaded the entire lands and they built this giant capital building right here so what they rejected the Targaryens advance and the Targaryens came and burned it all down to the ground like right when it was completed it was supposed to be the biggest castle of all castles unpenetrable unyielding and the Targaryens burned the entire family alive in the castle so it is currently a big ruin right now but you can upgrade it now the other thing about heron hall which i'll be interested to know in this mod is it's supposed to be haunted which will be very interesting to see if that has any things my vassal roderick has arrived at court with bandaged arm and hunger for vengeance he tells me that my son and heir wendell has been running rampant all over oakwood your boy fancies himself a duelist he turned up at my doorstep and challenged me in front of everyone i had no choice but to accept this is not the first time either i am but the last in the long line of victims um let's see I want them to fight, but I don't want to give you. Well, since you will, let's go ahead. I don't want to fight them. The duels will cease. Yeah, the duels will cease. I don't want to spend gold because I'm trying to save up for those manor houses. We will be strong. We will be strong. Okay. Thorthmore, an intricate bard popular with the common folk, has arrived at my court. A local landowner encouraged him to seek me out as so he might perform for myself and my household. Prior to the performance, he came to me and asked what sort of music would be most pleasing to my ears. Uh, I don't want to spend money. Take your music elsewhere, Vagrant. <laughs> We're saving. We're saving. We're savers. Which country am I from? I'm from the United States, my friend. Yeah, but we are in Game of Thrones right now. I befriended you. I could give you... No, we'll just lose the progress. No need to get stressed out of that. Greetings, uh, greetings, my modest vassal. I would like for your son, w Will Willis Wode, to become the spy, uh, the squire. Who's this? My son. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can take that, son. That's fine. That's my, that's my spare. That's my spare, my friend. 
Is this uh, after Daenerys Targaryen or before? This is before. So this is kind of at the start of Game of Thrones. So Robert is currently the ruler of the Stormlands and the Iron Throne. So he owns the, cr the Crownlands. So right now, Daenerys is kind of like over here in, in the Easterlands. I'm not sure if she's going to come back with the dragons or not. That would be something a little bit spooky. Can you do something with the island of the children in the forest? I don't know. Right now, it doesn't look like it. It seems impassable terrain. But maybe there might be an option if I upgrade. Oh, here, speaking of upgrade, I think we have enough to get the manor house. No, we need a little bit more. We made a friend. Let's go. Friendship till the very end. You're hereby invited? No, no, no. I'm not interested in attorneys. Don't invite me to attorneys. I'm not strong. I'm a very scared man. Let's see if we can befriend our... You have an 89% chance. You have a 100% chance. We'll befriend you. You're like an important vassal too. So that's a good one to befriend. Someone said someone said Corgi was from Germany yesterday. No, Corgi is not from Germany. Not at all. I've been to Germany. I lived in Germany for like three months. But as I've mentioned before, I was mostly on a boat. So did not not really get to experience the land. But now we're just chilling. Wait until we get about four more gold. Uh, no, no, no. Unfortunate misunderstanding was that to steam power. Yeah. Oh, um, we'll take it down to 95%. I think it might still be at 100. Yeah, it's still at 100. So that didn't do anything to us. We're perfectly fine on that front. We just need to build up our capital and we're finally able to do that. We'll get the manor house going. That'll give us 0.3 gold. And I think once we, this gives the supply limit. That's interesting. What does the farms do? Farm gives holding taxes. And so I might actually replace the regiment clearing. Oh, that gives so many good things. What does this do? This gives garrisons. I don't know. I would really love to have the apiaries because these give development. Development growth, which is going to be so important. So I might get that instead of the farms. Okay, I have a friend. Let's see. We can redouble effort, get some stress. We'll just lose progress. There's no rush on this. We've got nothing but time because we're just building up right now not doing anything just kind of waiting for a right opportunity to strike and those are going to come with getting the manor house and then the apiary so that's going to cost another 200 gold so we will wait for that and just go ahead and uh save up a little bit you should always have a bit of gold before before you buy something that is very true uh in the late stages of the game oh we befriended our friend yes let's go Mas maester willard has become our friend we've gained a new uh track there so let's go ahead and get confidence which will give us minus five percent stress gain per friend which means we have minus or that doubled up twice uh you're my friend you had an 89 percent chance what was the chances of befriending you 87 why is my son not wanting to be my friend he really doesn't want to be my friend uh generous liege uh i have more important people to impress i don't even know who you are oh that was my that's my liege i maybe should have impressed him okay well, you know a thing or two about court alliances. The Lord of Bri Briarwood should Briar White should possess a broad range of skills. My wife says, pursing her lips. I could acquire some new tomes, preparing a few assignments to do you a little. What subject are you most interested in? I like military theory. Let's get our military up a little bit so we can have a little bit more soldiers. So if the time comes when we're able to strike on somebody, we'll be able to do that more effectively. A wandering hedge knight. Emmett, a hedge knight, has arrived at my court. He's requested permission to stay at the keep for a short while before he resumes his travels. In return, he has offered me service for the duration of his stay. You've got 12 for us. Welcome. Uh, okay. Emmett gains. I asked, I tasked Emmett with a rather simple matter, overseeing some of my small folk while they completed some of their manual labor. I had levied for them. Emmett did indeed oversee them, but with a heavier hand than might have been necessary. Okay, so he becomes, let's see. He becomes callous. Ah. Okay. Oh, but he gets a new trait. He'll become a trained fighter or skilled fighter. Yeah, skilled fighter. It's Emmett is quite the tactician. Okay, he gets open terrain expert. Uh, We can get him. Yeah, I like this man. Join my court. Join my court. You will hopefully become a knight. Yeah, you're literally my best knight already with 18 prowess. That is wonderful. Good news on that front. What's this game? This is CK3. This is the Game of Thrones mod. So currently we are in the Game of Thrones universe. And we've made a new friend. Let's go. So as you can see, we're in the Riverlands right now in Hall. We're the small... 
I wish to reward your subject. I'm here offering you the position of chancellor. Yes, we will take that. That will give us a prestige bonus. We jump from 4.2 to 5.6. And uh, our, our liege died. We have a new liege. Oh, little baby boy. Little baby boy. Maybe Heron Hall is uh, haunted because that man had died rather quickly. Let's go ahead and get started again. What is going on here? Construction show, slow down. Mismanaged population. Why, why does everyone hate me? Mismanaged population. Okay, well, there's nothing I can do about that. That looks like it was only uh, treated there before. Only 18, you be need better knights? Yeah, but I'm only a small count, so the options are limited. Venison, elk, quail. There are so many exotic things to try in this world. I, as plate after plate of exqu uh, exquisite meat is placed before me, I cannot help but wonder what more is out there, what more flavorful adventures I can try. We'll try it all. We'll see what that does. On my quest for rare meats, a thought has taken root in my mind. I can scarcely admit it even to myself, but I cannot help but wonder what human flesh tastes like. I was just wondering if we're going to become a cannibal. As a servant of at court sickens and stands on door death's doorstep, I order him to be placed in my private care. What does cannibal do? I don't want to do that. Wait, I leave it to you guys. Yes or no, cannibal? Do we become a cannibal? No? Okay, I'm getting a lot of no's. All right. We will, we will gain the piety. We'll gain a little bit of stress. But we do get another perk here. So let's go with Flatterer, which will increase our Befriend scheme and hopefully be able for us to get these guys who are slightly more on the edge. You're still 53. You monster. What about you? 87. We'll try you next. We do have an option. Let's see. We can lawfully imprison Willow. Who is Willow? My courtier. She is a fornicator done oh this is new this is rude okay that's a new trait very interesting uh no need for me to do that greetings lord walton of briar white i have heard great things about you i am interested in starting a written conversation i hope this letter uh finds you willing for i am awaiting your swift reply let's go ahead and start exchanging letters maybe we can get a trade Ooh, we can gain poet which is diplomacy per level of fame. That's pretty good. We can gain journaler. Let's gain poet. There we go. We're a poet now. Huzzah. Thank you for your swift response. I'm looking forward to our correspondent. Please, I implore you. Pick the first subject for us to discuss. Uh, let's see what you like. You might be enjoying theologians. Maybe we can do etiquette together. Let's try it. Now oh, we made another friend. Let's go. Are you trying to make me feel like an idiot? Your last level was so full of obscura. I could not follow along one sentence in three. And to think I used to value your friendship. Oh, well, mission failed critically. <laughs> mission failed critically. Diplomacy trait. Okay, let's um, let's start going down this because I want to get to friendly council, which will give me two relations per skills for each friend I have on the council. So we need to get there. Part of the family is not going to matter that much. And then thicker of water won't matter that much. But it will prevent my son from murdering me, which is always a wonderful thing. We can declare war on Lord Ambrose. Ooh, he is very strong, though. Why is he so strong? He's got two alliances. What if we kill him? Who are your alliances? Oh, he's got the whole Heron Hall. Okay. I to cheer my knights. Hold on. Let's figure out why these guys are alive. This is the big alliance. I need to be able to knock this out. So Sheila and Ardwood. Who is Ardwood to you? Or who's Sheila? These are both located in... It's Oh, it's your brother. It's your brother. Can we kill your brother? No. Can we kill your wife? No. Okay, so I think we're just going to have to wait for... Are we older than you? You're 43. We're 56. Ah. Wait, how old is your brother? He's 41. His wife is 53. Yeah, there's no chance we're going to be able to kill his wife. Maybe we can kill you? No, no, no. I need to get in here. Milk. Can I kill you? We have a great chance of killing you. Let's go ahead and start that scheme. Get our, our uh, spy master... In on this as well we do get a little bit of extra stress but if we can gain milkstone this will be very very good for us oh and we do have about 300 gold so we need to spend that on the apiaries so let's go ahead and get that constructed 
get a little bit of extra gold for our boys. Okay, we'll start exchanging letters with you. Hopefully we do it better this time. Hey, Ray Teddy, how are you? Good to see you, my friend. Okay, uh, let's see. Do you, uh, tell me about the blessings of family. You have a lot of family. Maybe family would be nice. You like families. Uh, oh, yes. To think that, that you would ask about a subject so dear to me. You truly know me better than most. Since you have indulged me, I must ask if there's anything I can do for you. This will give us uh, an option for a learning challenge, or we can get a trade deal. Trade deal gives us holding taxes, so trade deal it is. Yes, we go up to four gold per month. Oh, did Swiss start streaming? Ah, I was one to join that one, but that's okay. Elman tells me about local celebrations in Milkstone. The home of Lord Ambrose is struggling with money. If it is held, it will draw a lot of people both high and low to the area. A perfect opportunity for infiltration. Yes, spin the gold. Spin the gold. Let's see, we have a 95% chance now. Oh, yes. Shout out to my dynasty. I have a granddaughter. Oh, she's calmly. Let's go. Uh, what's your son doing? I want to educate your son. Stewardship. Let's get him focused on that. That'll be really good for us. Educate the child. Yes, my courtier is perfect for that. There we go. She has a wonderful, wonderful steward or stewardship education. She's got four stars, which means she's very good at it. So now we just wait. We lie and wait for the Duke of Millstone to die. And once he dies, this will go to his son. He'll lose his alliances, and then we can quickly take over Milkstone. This is the way, brothers. Scheme discovered. Curses! No! My plans! Okay, let's see if we can invite anybody. We might still be able to get it done. We could spend money on these guys. How much does it cost? 68. Do it. How much does it cost? 55. No! Oh, wait. Lord Paramount Race Mace of the Reach has risen up against King Stannis of the Iron Throne. <gasps> the Iron Throne switched hands. In the Liberty War, I must choose to stand with King Than. Oh, we are not getting involved in this. Why won't you join me, my friend? Okay, we still have an 84% chance. Why won't you accept it? It said you would accept it. I need I need more people. No. You? Yes. The woods are a dangerous place. Ah. Oh. Keep going. He gains watchful, so our chances are going to be even lowered. But we now have enough people that we can get it done again. Okay. Still worth. Still worth. Let's see what this uh, rebellion's looking like. Wow, just about everyone's rebelling against the... Every single person is rebelling against the Iron Throne in this one. There's only a few places that have stayed loyal. One of them, which being the Riverlands. Uh, let's go fam Heart of the Family. And then what other things? We can claim our Leash's title. It gets an un... Wait, I'm the Leash. That seems to be a bug. You want to train my grandson? No. I keep him close to me. We say strong. We say strong. Where are the White Walkers? Oh, hopefully not coming anywhere near uh, near us soon. We're very small. We're just working our way up to get to Heron Hall. That's all we really want. Uh, injure scheme. Lord Ambrose has discovered that I'm the mastermind behind the plot. Oh. I can't murder him because he knows. What? Can I murder you now? No. You're probably even less. Kind of the same. Try and murder you anyways. 